guys, Adam Madison with our HS panel. We've got Crystal, we've got Rebecca, we've got Jasmine. All right, we're talking about the hottest looks of the week. Let's start off with Lady Gaga and Bob On. What do you think about this look? Jasmine from Motobot.com. I like it. I mean, it's so funny that other people wore the same skirt and nobody cared about it. Kate Boz wore it, Zoe Saldana. They both wore the Bob On draped skirt. But when Gaga wore it, then it became something. I think it's fierce. And I love the belt. I love the shoulder pads. Like, I would rock this outfit. I mean, Crystal, do you see me rocking this outfit? I see you rocking anything, Diana. <laughs> I really do. I wasn't a huge fan of it. I like her coming out of an egg. I like her wearing meat. I like Gaga in a song. Clothing, not so much. But maybe she got a defection for the beach, so she decided to actually go for something <laughs> a little bit. Get on some toxic. antibiotics and wear another <laughs> animal, damn it. Rebecca, what do you think? I like the outfit. I think the, the make under on Gaga is a good look. It's working for Nicki Minaj. Clearly, she's taking the tip. And I do think she looks like she could be on the Jetsons, but it works. But is it working for a music career? You cover music all day long on stereo, dude. I mean, I don't know if the toned down look really is going to affect the music career, but right now she's not selling records anyway, so. All right, moving on. Beyonce, someone who is doing amazing on tour. She's wearing Roberto Cavalli. I can't even look at the dress because I'm focusing on her beautiful bob cut. I actually want to cut my hair looking at her. I mean, what do you think about this look? Orange is a really hard color to wear, but Beyonce made it happen because she incorporated in the blush and in the highlight. It's hard to wear orange, so if you don't work it into your beauty look, it's just not going to happen. Not going to happen? What do you think about this look? It's Beyonce. Like, when has she ever really gone wrong? I, I know. Mean, she's her potato sack. It's totally She hot. could. She's amazing. Her haircut's amazing, whether it's the pixie cut or the bob. I love her. You can't tell me nothing about Beyonce. I loved it as well. She could do no wrong in my eyes. She's like Benjamin Buttons. It feels like the older she gets, the younger she looks. It's the strangest thing, but I loved it. I want to be tricky what she's drinking. Pass, on, pass that on to me. All right, moving on. Rihanna and Rihanna for River Island. Now, I adore Rihanna. I love her style. I think she's a trendsetter, but this outfit is a go. I, I hate it. What do you think about it? I mean, she's smart to make money off of her streetwear look, and I get it. Riri, then it's R&I, River Island, but it looks a lot like this other brand, KTZ. Google it, and you'll see. It's very, very similar. Would you wear this outfit? I would not wear this particular River Island outfit. There are tons of looks from the new collection that I love. But this one for Rihanna, I mean, it just kind of looks like she's wearing one of Kanye's outfits with the, the skinny pants and the, the long skirt tunic thing. And I'm not feeling that look. What about you? I just feel like she woke up one day and she was like, hey, I'm tired of being so great looking. What can I do to make myself look crazy? I'm going to dress like a man. <laughs> I'm guessing you're not buying the outfit. In true Riri fashion, I doubt she cares what any of us think. I wouldn't take the outfit for free if she gave it to me. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for joining the panel. I'm Donna Madison with Rebecca, with Jasmine, and Crystal. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.